the rains or the rains retreat ended this morning at dawn. And it's traditional in Thailand and other Theravada countries that there's a special merit making during the alms round. It's in commemoration of an old tradition. That there was one rains retreat where the Buddha went up to heaven for the entire rains retreat to teach his mother. His mother had been reborn as a deva. And he went up for the three months, taught his mother and the other devas there. And then at the end of the three months came down. No, the human beings hadn't been able to put food in his bowl, so word came that he was going to be coming down in a town called Sankasa. So they thronged there, and the Buddha came down a stairway from heaven, accompanied by devas. And people came in trying to put food in his bowl, and they couldn't, so they wrapped up their rice and leaves and threw it <laughs> into his bowl. That's why we had that rice dessert wrapped up in leaf this morning. Of course, with COVID, we don't have crowds of people here anymore. But we can think about the old traditions. And this tradition goes way back. King Ashoka put a column at the spot where the Buddha supposedly came down. It had an elephant on the top. I saw it about 30 years ago. But the, basically the story comes down to gratitude. I mean, he went up to heaven to teach his mother how to gratitude. So even the Buddha. Realize that he had debts of gratitude. So it's good to look around. What debts of gratitude do you have? And you do what you can to pay people back. If they're not around, you make merit and you're dedicated to them. At the same time, you try to think of whatever goodness you picked up from them and whatever good lessons you learned, or whatever help you received from them, and you pass it on. Because it's in passing the goodness on that human society becomes a good place to live. If you're just on the receiving end, it's like a pipe that's gotten clogged. The water goes in there, gets stagnant. You want to unclog the pipe, and then the water flows through and it stays clean. So think about the debts of gratitude you have. And be happy to repay them, because in doing so you make human society a better place to live. And you develop good qualities that you can take with you. That's one of the ironies of making merit. You give away, give away, you leave things in the world, and then they follow you. So think of all the goodness you can leave in the world, and it's going to follow you. The goodness you try to hold on to slips out of your fingers. So let's keep that image in mind.